हेलो किड्स इस क्लास वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी अबाउट द हाउस वाई वी नीड अ हाउस हाउ द हाउस हेल्प अस एंड काइंड्स ऑफ हाउसेस एंड टाइप्स ऑफ रूफ्स सो लेट अस स्टार्ट द क्लास चिल्ड्रन नाउ वेर वी आर लिविंग वी आर लिविंग इन अ होम वी ऑल नीड अ प्लेस टू लिव इन वी ऑल नीड अ प्लेस टू लिव नाउ चिल्ड्रन That's why that place is called a house. A house protects us from cold. It protects us from rain and wind. It protects us from animals and robbers. A house is a home when a family lives in it. Children, how the house help us? It protects us from cold, rain and wind, and especially from animals and robbers children we can't stay more days outside if it's rainy we want a shelter we are safe in a house yes we all need a place that will protect us from many things that place is called a house a house is a home when a family lives in it what is the difference between house and home house means a empty building that is called a house in that building when a family like we all live that house is called a home so now we'll see different kinds of houses there are different kinds of houses bungalows and apartments are made of bricks stone and cement they are generally found in cities and towns there are different kinds of houses like bungalows apartments huts igloos these all are kinds of houses first let us see about bungalows and apartments these houses are made of bricks stones and cement they are generally we can see these type of houses in cities yes next is hut huts are made of stones mud and straw these houses are mostly found in villages children huts are made of stones mud and straw and we some huts are made of leaves grasses and many more straws okay these house houses are mostly found in villages these type of houses where we can see we can see in the villages next is igloo some people live in a house made of snow it is called an igloo igloo we can see in the islands okay children these houses are made of stones of like big solid snow these are made up of solid snow okay these houses also we can use to live some people live in houses made of snow that is called an igloo some houses can be moved from one place to another still now what we have saw the houses like bungalows apartments huts and igloo cannot be moved from one place to another they are fixed at one place they cannot move now we are going to see some houses can be moved from one place to another first one is house boat see in the picture children that is a house boat that is made on the boat a house boat floats on water Bo house boat can be float on the water it can be moved from one place to another where we can see many things and we can stay in that next is caravan a caravan is a house on wheels see children in that house we can see many more things like we can sleep we can watch some tvs and all see how the caravan is made in that 
we can stay more days okay that house is a can be moved can be moved from one place to another place next next is tent a tent is a house made of canvas tent is also a type of house it is made up of canvas can in that we can stay safely okay it is caravan is better than this house when we go for some camps and summer holidays we can't take our home with us so that we can made make a house like tent okay these houses are made of canvas understood children now we'll go different types of roofs see children all the houses cannot have the same roofs roof what do you mean by roof the structure that forming the upper covering of a building that covers a building from upper side that is called roofs house see in the first picture children that is a flat roof that house has a flat roof in warm places the houses have flat roofs see in the next picture houses in places which get heavy rains and snow have sloping roofs see children these houses have the sloping roofs because these houses are built in the place where where that place get heavy rains and snow so that the rain and snow can be come down from the roofs so there we can see the sloping roofs i hope you all have understood the types of houses and i types of roofs thank you children bye take care read this lesson once or twice children for better understanding